Okay, we're back at it again today. Guys, we got big news. They finally released the checklist for Panini Prism. Well, only one day before release, but at least we got something. It's not a complete checklist with all the autographs and everything like that, but let's go through it. They got some great rookie cards in here now, finally. I went over a few I thought they should pick. They definitely did pick a few of those, and let's get right into it. All right, so we already know these guys are coming. So here we got base set checklist now, and you can see they have the verticals, and they'll have horizontals, but we can just run through a few of these names on here. We don't need to look at all of them. Some of these guys have been around for a long time. Here we go, though. One of my top picks was Hamzat Chemaev. This guy's an absolute monster in the cage. We're going to get his rookie card. This is going to be highly sought after. He's looking to fight. Potentially, they're talking Nick Diaz now, which would be amazing. We'll see him versus Nick Diaz. Good stuff. Hamzat, highly collectible. Right below Hamzat, we come in Oscar Oskarov. I believe this guy's probably going to get the next title shot. After Moreno, obviously, they want to do that rematch because it was so exciting, so much fun. Oscar Oskarov has just been dominating dudes on the ground. He looks tremendously good. I just don't see him not being a high contender for the rest of his career. So Oscar Oskarov, we're going to see him. He's going to be worth a pickup. Now we have a few other people in here. These guys all have their rookie cards. They're all good. Walker, Rochick, Edwards, great stuff. Stamen, I don't know if we're going to see him as a champion. Stamen, I mean, Dober, Hermanson, these guys are all out there. Alex Perez, I'm not 100% sure if he has a rookie card or not. He was a top contender. He's probably still number three or four in the division right now. Very, very high pickup there, potentially. Then we have come down a few other good guys. Brandon Moreno, I don't know if he beats uh, Davis and Figueredo, but... He's a top contender in the division, nonetheless. We'll keep moving down. Nikita Krylov, a monster. Maybe a good pickup. Let's move down a little bit faster here. We got Cater, OSP, O'Malley, Neil, all these guys. They're already out. They already have great rookie cards. A bunch of them wearing Chrome. Nunez, Brown, Costa, Dan Ige. Super Sadiq, another guy I've talked about highly. Sadiq is a monster. Very good. Potentially, he's got a long career ahead of him if he sticks with it. And he's got the power behind him. Now, another guy I picked, I said they need to make a rookie card. The only reason why I, he was honorable mentions was I told you they made one art card. It's a one-on-one. It's the only card I ever made. But he still technically has that card. So I put him in honorable mention. But this will be Giga Kiatse's rookie card in Prism. He's fighting this weekend. Is going to be a huge pickup if he can win this weekend. It's a pretty good match for him. I believe that will be highly sought after. I believe he's going to win one more, two more, and he'll be looking to challenge for a title fight pretty soon too. Except that division's very tied up at the moment. And we got Dern, Holloway, Jan, until all these guys already have it. Will be good. You'll get their prism, technically their first prism card, first Panini card. Uh, Yuri. Fights this weekend. If he beats Reyes, Reyes uh, he'll be probably next in line to challenge for the title. Great pickup right here. Uh, another guy I really like, I'm very high on, Marab Dashvili. He fights this weekend. Also, this guy is, they call him the machine. He's hes an absolute warrior. Has a gas tank for, for days and days. He's just been dominating guys with just pure work ethic. Not even that he's out striking them because he's a wrestler grappler. But his striking game's getting better. He's learning how to faint. He's, he's just a machine. He's unbelievable. Chris Weidman, we all know what happened to him. Can't even get that out of my head, to be honest with you. Tanner Bozer, I don't know if he'll make a big splash up there in the heavyweights because he's pretty small, but pretty good. There's a beat, uh, Calderwood, all these already have rookie cards. Come down, we got Jones, Ikenta, Ladd, Cody. They all have cards. I don't know if we need to talk about Rodolfo. Uh, here we go. Alex Caceres, potentially nice. Kobe's just going to be have tons of inserts. He should be a nice pickup. I know he's not even close to a rookie, but Adesanya's first prism. I imagine that's going to sell either way. Josh Emmett, we haven't seen him fight in a long time. He, uh, what did he do, break his ankle or blew out his knee in one of his last fights, and he still continued on. Absolute warrior. Magomed and Kalayev. Is another guy I told you I'd love to see his rookie card printed in Prism. Here it is. This is a must-buy. This guy is going to... I think he wins the title when he goes up there. 
you never know. I feel like Glover is actually going to beat Jan, in my opinion, but that's a whole different ball game. Magomed has been just dominating guys. What he did to Kutalaba twice, what he's done to... He's just at another level than a lot of these guys. Huge. You never know. Maybe we'll see uh, Hamzat go up and fight Magomed. It'll be a great fight. Sanhagen, another guy good to get his prism. Rosenstruck, I don't, uh, the heavyweights... <laughs> Heavyweight stuck right now. It's going to be Francis or Jones. Maybe Steep Bay returns, but that's a tough division for to see, really see someone else take that title away from Francis. I don't know. You never know. Nurmagomedov, Spazian already's out. Blakovich will be a nice one. Champ has his nice following with his own country there. Owen, Marvin Vittori, another monster. Very excited to see in this set. I mean, Usman, Sterling, Hua, these guys are all out. Hooker, Walt Harris, Gastelum, Hebos was 2020. They just printed her rookie card. Los Angeles, Elk, and Song. This is another one I'm very excited to see. Jan Zhaoshin, be great. Also, Jimmy Crew, I think, has a great career ahead of him. I'm not 100% sure if Crew has a rookie card. We can take a look real quick here. Let's just take a look on here. Jimmy Crew. UFC. Yeah, that's what I thought. Does not have a rookie card for Jimmy Crew. So, Crew, another guy, great pickup. Another guy I mentioned in my video. I'd love to see his rookie card, Kevin Holland. Guy's got a good following. He's good for the sport. He's only going to get better. He loves to fight every week, and the kid just loves to fight. That's a phenomenal thing in this business. You get a guy who wants to fight. Every month. Like Cowboy Cerrone. These guys that love to fight. They gain a nice following. Kevin Holland. Must, must buy a rookie card. Kiesa. Ol Oliveira. And all these guys. They've been around. Figueredo has been out for a few years. His card. Serling on. Now this guy. Has the potential to go up and challenge for a title shot. Heavyweight title shot. Whoever dethrones Francis. Is going to be. Well. They're going to be very famous. People are going to watch that fight. They're going to watch all Francis's fights. Going forward, the guy's so big, huge following, really nice guy. Love that he has the belt. There's going to be guys challenging him. And Don is one of the guys I believe has true potential to be great. He just has the frame, the speed, the, the skill set. He's got everything. It's tough in that division because everybody's got power and hands and everything up there. Very tough. I mean, we'll see Tatiana and Zhang. Another guy for rookie card... Buckley right here. I don't believe Buckley has a rookie card out. It'd be great. And then Michael Chandler. Another guy. He's going for a title fight very soon. He has a real shot at being the champ in the UFC. I mean, he'll have all types of marks on his back. They, they're going to want that belt. I mean, Connor's fighting again. All these guys, that division stacked. But Chandler. We'll get to see Chandler rookie card here. Be good. He could potentially be the champion very soon. I just wanted to run over this checklist real quick, guys. You can see this is on Beckett. Uh, cardboard connection doesn't even have it posted yet. It's also not posted on Panini's website yet. I haven't seen it. So hopefully we can get the full autograph list and everything very soon. I mean, the set drops tomorrow. So it's ridiculous that they don't have it out already. Thank you very much, guys, for joining me. I just want to go over that update. I know not everybody realizes that the checklist is finally out. And I'll see you guys soon.